Today we are continuing our Yoyoi inspired organic drawing. We have been looking at microorganisms and looking at the different patterns and shapes that they can create. Now we are going to add bright and bold colors to our artwork to really make them stand out and look like pop art. Now it's time to color in our artwork. Now, we have a lot of really cool stuff going on, so we want to add a lot of really cool colors. Now I have some highlighters. You can choose some bright colored crayons because you're going to want to use very bright and bold colors. So I'm going to start coloring one and choose which colors I'd like to do. Maybe switch off a little bit. And the fluorescent colors are definitely going to help make this artwork pop. That's why you really wanted to get rid of a lot of that pencil line. So you can go ahead and start planning out your colors. You can follow along with my colors or make your own color choices. But I'm going to use bright colors. And if you're at home and you have some highlighters around the house, you can definitely color this in using highlighter. Heather, it looks way brighter in person. Coloring in the background. Now that I colored in all of my microorganisms, I can choose if I would like to do a color in the background. So, I actually like this light green. And I'm going to color in the background of it. I could have left it white, but I think it looks nice with the background. And that's how I'm going to finish off my artwork.
cutting out the organic shape and pasting it to a color background. Our last and final step is we are going to cut out this page and I'm gonna have you decide what color paper you would like to glue it on to. So I'm going to get my scissor and I'm going to cut out this big organic shape first. Now I have my big organic shape. And I'm going to, I think I'm gonna choose the black. And then I can get my glue stick and I'm going to glue it down. Do not forget to put your name on the back. I could do that with a pencil. 